I'm Jesse. And I'm Daniel. And we're the co-founders of Cord. Culture over record. Me and Marley in the cut, that's my blood like I'm bleeding. We're talking money, music, fashion, and things like you scheming. I told him, I swear down we're gonna blow. He laughed and said, I know. Tell the truth, I don't think he believed me. But fun, both hands on the will come. We created Chord to bring the fun and authenticity back to being a music lover. The music coming out of the UK right now over the last five years has been crazy. And we just wanted to create something that showcased all of this to give a voice to the people who love music and the culture. Finding inspiration to create engaging formats came from some of our favourite channels on YouTube such as Jubilee, Hollywood Reporter and Cut to name a few. I mean, we even gained inspiration from activities you'd play growing up in school and sometimes it was just a case of good brainstorming sessions where we'd be in a room just going back and forth, bouncing off different ideas. You'd be surprised how many ideas we've actually come out with just sitting in a room and half of those haven't even come out yet. So to be fair, I'd say it's a really good sign for us. I mean, the crazy thing about it all is the two of us, we actually used to have a YouTube channel where we used to speak on everything to do with music, whether that was US music or, or UK. But I guess the great thing about having a platform like Chord is where you get a range of opinions, we won't feel boxed in to do a certain piece of content. So to be honest, it allows us to evolve seamlessly. With a platform, there's no bias attached. We're not representing a specific opinion or viewpoint. For us, it's about the wider conversation and we just want to do this in the most authentic way possible. It's called Behind the Hits. It's really about giving a voice to some of the innovators within our scene who don't necessarily get a spotlight. We want to take it even further and bring on everyone from directors to songwriters to engineers to managers who will all be able to give their thoughts on music, where it's going and share some of the gems they've picked up over the years. Yeah, the studio is a really cool place for us to film. Uh, people always ask where we film. Um, they love the white background, they like how clean it looks. Um, so it's just become a part of our brand almost. It's become a really familiar place to us and our audience definitely appreciate the consistency in location. We've built a really good relationship with the studio owner too. We've seen our growth over the last six months from where we could barely pull off one shoot to filming like four pieces of content in a day. He's definitely helped us when it comes to advice on like setting up and staging. Um, he's always down to help us out with equipment stuff like that so it's good to kind of build that kind of relationship um, and work with someone who wants to see you win and is always down to help one thing i definitely take pride in and it makes me so so happy is the range of opportunities cord can provide for people at such an early stage of its journey it's mad because like me as a music lover i'd say our shoots would be the one place i'm able to meet like-minded people especially considering the times that we're in where there aren't that many opportunities to see new faces. The beauty of the shoot is that everyone there has something to offer, you know, whether you're an artist, you're a writer, or you're just a music lover like myself. So the connections that can be made are crazy. Suddenly you'll see cast members working on each other's projects together, or someone's giving someone else an opportunity to master their craft. But ultimately, it's amazing to see how so many people just take their passion seriously and bring that same energy to our shoots. And what's also amazing is having our own crew which consists of friends or people that just want to be part of the journey. And that's great because they understand the vision from the very beginning and they're part of the foundations now. So having that common goal makes working together so easy. Yeah, damn, a lot has changed since we were last here, man, which is a blessing in itself, to be honest. But yeah, like during the first lockdown, we came here to chat about a few new ideas where we see called going and what we actually need to do to like achieve consistency. Now, five months later, we've dropped 18 videos in a row. And it's crazy because off the back of coming here, that was the first time we went to that studio. So it's actually funny how like everything just comes around full circle. But yeah, a lot of the time we spent here was just about understanding what our goals were, making sure we were achieving those goals. And what's mad is the amount of content ideas that we came up with here, because at the time, we had only released two different concepts, so it was really just a case of how can we broaden what we're doing here to make sure Chord could be one of the most dynamic platforms in the scene. I see Chord changing the landscape of music content in the UK. We want to bring excitement back to our scene, really build a platform impactful enough to support the amount of talent coming out right now. We both see it in the future as the biggest brand within music. We want to bring a crazy amount of innovation to our scene, and not just in content, but experiences too and everything else that goes along with music. Definitely more to come. 
if you love the culture, you love cause. I'm Daniel. I'm Jesse. And catch us on the next stop. Yeah.